Now let us see this example. Design a Moray machine to find the once complement of a given binary number. We know what is a binary number. A binary number is made up of zeros and ones. So let me have a binary number like this 1011. So binary number contains zeros and ones. So here sigma that is input alphabet contains 0 and 1. Here what is the, uh, here what we need to find? We have to find once complement of the given binary number. So what is once complement? Ones will be converted to zeros and zeros will be converted to ones. So here we have 1. So this 1 will be converted to 0. 0 will be converted to 1. 1 will be converted to 0. 1 will be converted to 0. So output alphabet also contains zeros and ones. Output alphabet is represented by delta symbol. So delta is equal to 0 and 1. So now let us design the more emission. Here we can solve this problem by using two methods. The first method is by taking three states. The second method is by taking two states. Now let us solve the problem in the two methods. So method one uh, by considering three states. By considering three states. Uh, let the initial state is Q0. Initial state is Q0. Let output of Q0 is 0. We can take output as output of Q0 as either 0 or 1. According to that, uh, we can change the transitions. Let output of Q0 is 0. Next. Uh, here, uh, if, if we pass, if the input is 0, if the input is 0, then we will get a state called Q1. So, Q1 accepts 0 as the input. If input is 0, then what is the output? 1. So, the output of Q1 is 1. Likewise, we need one more state. That state is Q2. Q2 accepts 1 as the input. If the input is 1, then that input will be passed to the Q2. If the input is 1, if the input is 1, then what is the output? 0. So the output of Q2 is 0. Next, more emission and mill emissions are nothing but DFAs. So each state must use uh, the symbols present in the input alphabet. So here on Q0, 0 is applied as well as 1 is applied. If 0 is the input, then 1 is the output. If 1 is the input, then 0 is the output. Now we have to apply input symbols uh, such as 0 and 1 on uh, Q1 and Q2. Here what is the output of Q1? 1. When we will get output as 1? If the input is 0. If the input is 0, then we will get output as 1. If the input is 0, then we will get output as 1. Next, here output of Q2 is 0. When we will get output as 0 if the input is 1. If the input is 1, then the output is 0. Okay. Next, we have to apply 0 on Q2 as well as 1 on Q1. Here, output of Q1 is 1. So, when the output will be 1 if the input is 0. So, if we apply 0 on Q2, if we apply 0 on Q2, then we will get 1 as the output. So, likewise, here output of Q2 is 0. So, when output is 0, if the input is 1. So, if we apply 1 on Q1, we will get 0 as the output. So, now uh, Q1 has uh, uh, transitions on 0 and 1. Uh, Q2 uses... Uh, uh, a zero symbol as well as one symbol. So this is the uh, more emission for solving this problem. Now let us check whether this mission is correct or not. So for that let us take an input string. Let the string is 1011. So 1011 means what is the output? 0100 is the output. So initially we are at Q0 state. 
initially we are at q naught state so q naught on 1 q naught on 1 goes to q2 next q2 on 0 q2 on 0 goes to q1 next q1 on 1 q1 on 1 goes to q2 q2 on 1 goes to q2 what is the output of q0 0 output of q2 output of q2 0 output of q1 output of q1 is 1 output of q2 is 0 output of q2 is 0 we know that uh, uh, in more mission if the size of the input string is n then the size of the output string will become n plus 1 here the input string size is 4 whereas the output string size is 5 so here there is no need of this 0 so we have to neglect this 0 so here the output is 0 1 double 0 so 1 is converted to 0 0 is converted to 1 1 is converted to 0 1 is converted to 0 so in this way we can design the more mission for solving this problem here more mission means output is same irrespective of the input here output of q naught is 0 whether it is whether we apply 0 or 1 likewise the output of q1 is 1 whether we apply 0 or 1 likewise output of q2 is 0 when we apply either 0 or 1 so that's why in more mission we have to specify the output within the state now let us see the second method the second method is the most efficient method uh, by taking two states by taking two states so method two by taking two states here we have only two states we know that more mission or melee mission doesn't have any final state so here we will have only initial state we don't have any final state okay let the second state is uh, q let the first state is q naught let the output of the q naught is zero it is our choice we can take one also there is no problem let here the output is one let the output of q0 is 0 and output of q1 is 1. When the output will be 0 if the input is 1. If the input is 1, then only output will be 0. Okay. Next here, 1 is applied on q0. Now we have to apply 0 on q0. 0 on q0 means we will go to q1. q1 output is 1. Okay. So, so this is 1's complement. 1's complement means 0 will be converted to 1. So, 0 on q0, we will go to q1, output is 1. Likewise here, output of q1 is 1. When the output is 1, if the input is 0. If the input is 0, then only output is 1. Now, we have to apply 1 on the q1. So, 1 means the output should be 0. So, we can make the transition to q0. So, 1 on q1 means it will go to q0, output is 0. So, this is the more mission for solving this problem with the help of the two states so 0 and 1 are applied on both the states now let's check whether this mission is correct or not so for that uh, uh, let us take the input string 1 0 double 1 so initially we will be at uh, q naught state q naught on 1 means q naught only next to q naught on 0 q1 q1 on 1 q1 on 1 q naught next to q naught on 1 q0 on 1 q0 only okay what is the output of q0 0 0 0 0 what is the output of q1 1 so here a more mission means here we have to neglect this bit if the input is 4 here we are getting uh, n plus 1 as the output so we can neglect uh, this leftmost bit so the output is 0 1 double 0 so 1 is converted to 0 0 is converted to 1 1 is converted to 0 1 is converted to 0 so in this way we can solve the problem. So, in this way, we can design a more emission to find one's complement of given binary number.